Hi everyone, this is the final project in tangible user interface. We have two security issues that are affected in great scale by technology nowadays. By using advanced communication and security technology, nowadays we have different ways of home and family 24-7 security. We have chosen to use Satel, which is a Poland company that deals with security system. The programming part is done through Versa, and now we will explain all the features that this platform has. This is the control panel of the status, all the wires that are connected to it, which help us to identify, to identify our alarming system. This is its keyboard, which help us to activate and deactivate the alarm. This is the motion sensor. Also, we have the vibra sensor up there. This is the siren, which is activated only if alarm occurs. We have the transformator here in the middle, which is for the currency purposes. And also we have the battery. If there is no currency for the alarming system, it will have a backup plan as the, this battery. We have the panic button here, which is also modified as an ambulance button. It depends how we are programming it. We have also our glass break detector, which help us uh, identify the glasses broken in the stores or in the object. We have also here the smoke detector. As we have mentioned, we have also uh, some lockers in our houses. We can see this magnet, which is activated if the, a locker is open. So now we are arming the, our Bulgari system. We have 12 seconds until we have to get out from all the sensors. So this is the counter. And now we are trying only the Vibra sensor. So after it, the alarming is activated, if someone tries to enter the house from over the wall, until the wall is not uh, being panicked, this is staying in normal mode, but as soon as the wall is activated, this one will do its job. So. so now we are trying to identify how this smoke detector will work. This is how how we put smoke in it, cigarette smoke, and we will see when it will be activated. Now this is it. So now, as the example we showed in our progress, we have a locker, if you want to lock it, and if you are home, you want to check if someone will open it. This is the right choice we, that we implemented in our alarming system. Uh, as soon as we open this door, we will have an alarming system. As now, you can see. Now we can see how the glass brick detector will give us an alarm. This is not the right voice. Until we get the glass brick. This is our panic button, or we can use it as an uh, uh, ambulance button. If a person that uh, is operating with this alarming system, if they are having problems, they can, this can send automatically signal to the monitoring station. So this is the right thing. As soon as we open it, we have open zone here, number 5, and uh, of course the signal is sent to the monitoring station. So now we are arming our alarming system to see how this motion detector will work. This is an entry delay which causes alarm only after 10 seconds with entry. So now our Bulgari system is armed and when I will open my arm this will cause this motion detection so this is the light that shows us that there is motion and we can see how it waits at 10 seconds for disarming after these 10 seconds we will have an alarm